Yeah. It was too good of a deal. Warehouse sale? Hobo? Leather? Stay tuned. Hello, my name is Andrea. Welcome to my channel and thanks for joining me in the babe cave today. And yes, I got this bag at the greatest deal. <laughs> Hobo International, you know, as I said before, I get too many emails that are too tempting, but this one was an excellent deal. Um, and PSA, which is Public Shopping Addict, uh, I will link her channel down below. She's been opening up hobo bags for a while and I'm like, ah, I really like hobo. That is a great brand. Uh, they stand the test of time. You know, I've bought and sold many hobo because they're, they're really functional, great for every day. So anyway, <laughs> I got an email saying they were having a warehouse sale. <laughs> And I'm still blaming uh, Clara from PSA for I joined the email. <laughs> well, I found this bag. <clears throat> Let me just show you and then I'll give you the details. Here it is. Cute packaging. Looks like it's in a dust bag. The price I got for this bag is unbelievable. Because <laughs> I've now looked at it for you all and it, the price is a lot higher. But... Anytime you get a clearance or warehouse sale and you're looking for a new bag, click on it. Because they the deals you just can't beat. Okay, I will open it. It's a, a nice cloth dust bag for it. It says hobo. Very nice. I traded a hobo with Jackie from Jack's Bag Attack. I kind of regret that trade. No, I'm just kidding. I have a lot of bags, but anyway, let me show you what I got. So here it is. Here is this gorgeous hobo international. I guess hobo. Um, and let me tell you a little bit about this. Let's see. Okay, this is unfortunate. So this tassel, this is a tassel, was laying here <laughs> in their warehouse, I'm guessing. So I'm sure with time that'll come out. See what I'm talking about. Let me just tell you the name <clears throat> and color of this bag. It is the Cole. K-O-L-E shoulder bag, soft leather, in the color berry. Now, on camera, it might look more berry, but in person, it's almost a brown. <laughs> but slight berry. I really love the, the uh, woven features of this bag. Super nice. It also has a back pocket. Yes, and the hardware on this bag is the brushed antiqued brass hardware. And let's see. I want to tell you the deal I got on this bag. <laughs> and why you can't blame me for buying it. This bag was $46. Okay, 46 you heard that right. Of course, their shipping is kind of outrageous, but their shipping was $14.17, so I got this bag right here for $60.17. All leather. <laughs> Hobo. Here's the bottom. No feet. It's a shoulder bag, like, like the description says. Here's the side. It's a little wonky, uh, I'm guessing because it is from the warehouse, I'm going to have to shape it and do all that. But 
Here is the tassel. So let me read. There's something right here I want to read. It says, Meet soft hide leather. The leather is tanned using a natural process that leaves its beauty untouched. It is lightweight yet durable and will last for years if well loved. We suggest treating your bag with hobo leather protection before your first wear. Avoid contact with dark clothing that may transfer to your bag. Enjoy. And I guess this is the retail originally, not warehouse price. Uh, let's see if I can get that to focus. There is the tag. It says $228, genuine leather, and again, the color berry. So let me get this all unwrapped for you and be right back. So it, it is a cute cute shoulder bag and it has a tassel a giant tassel <laughs> with uh, the hobo little logo on right there if you can see it but yeah super nice and the length of this bag is 11 according to the website seven and a half and then the depth it's saying three and the shoulder drop is eight. So eight is, I like nine, but let's see. Oh yeah, it fits fine on my shoulder. Very cute, let me try again. <clears throat> here it is on my shoulder. And here's the zipper and the strap is just a smooth. Yeah, I'm gonna have to, <laughs> I think it's been in the warehouse too long, <laughs> but for 60 bucks, I am not going to complain. I'm just not going to do it. And let's see if this back pocket will fit my phone. Again, iPhone 15 Pro Max. I am doubting that this is going to fit. Oh my goodness, it fit in there. <laughs> this was deceiving because it did slide in there. It goes over farther inside than I thought. So your big phones will fit in the back, yes. <laughs> Everyone loves that, right? Not just me, I hope. Okay, so we've took taken a look at all the outside and there's the close up of the zipper. Look at the tassel. It's been wrapped for a while, so I'm, it needs to breathe. <laughs> Here's the inside. Let's take the paper out. Here's the inside. It has a zipper pocket, and then there's the hobo logo right there. Just a tan fabric, and on this side, it has one two slip pockets which has the divider which is nice very roomy um yeah this will definitely fit all your daily essentials and they have other colors uh like i said i found this on a bunch of sites but the prices range from you know 90 to 200 dollars. i even found it on amazon <laughs> but uh they have like a moss green color i i'm pretty sure they had black but I'll link it down below. I'm not affiliated. I just couldn't resist. I'm really liking woven. Uh, my quince bags, the woven. I just, I think it's really pretty. So, yeah. Very much like this bag. I don't think you could beat $60. And there is this right here. I'm guessing you can add a charm. Or they're probably wanting you to buy one of their bag charms, but you know, I have plenty. So that's nice. It has a little spot for you to put your own because it's not on this side. Yeah, this strap. <laughs> Once I start using this, it will come back to life. But what do you guys think? 
my new uh, Hobo International. And it, the leather on it is actually, back here is really soft. It's a soft leather, soft, smooth leather. I love that my phone fits in it. Yeah, I'm just gonna have to stuff it and get these handles in order. And uh, I think it'll be an, a fun carry, easy. I really like shoulder bags lately and this is a really nice size for every day, for me anyway. So I hope you enjoyed my unboxing of my hobo and I thank you all and don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, comment down below, you know, what you think. And I have been in <laughs> my little fossil barrel bag still. That was my, my bags that I'm wearing, but I wanted to share my new hobo. And don't forget to hit the bell for future notifications of my videos. And I appreciate all of you stopping over and watching me and commenting down below. And I love all the interaction. So keep it coming and let's uh, keep going to 1500 subs <laughs> and further from there. So thank you again and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.